Welcome back, everybody. It is time to lock down Arena. Let's jump into it, get our quick win for the day. This is episode 100 for the quick win. So we're going to see if our Merfolk Stomp can go at it in ranked play and do pretty well. I haven't played ranked play in this entire season. I haven't even started this entire season. So we'll see how it does in ranked play. And, uh,. Leave a like for episode 100 of Quick Wins. Uh, that is pretty cool. We've done 100 of these so far. Mm, yeah, we'll we'll keep this. This is a, this is all right. Okay. What are we playing against here, Mitts? Forest passing the turn. Interesting. Okay. So, I think we'll try to get a card draw here. River Sneak. Excellent. Wild Growth. Alright. Well, it's a good thing we got River Sneak. Tap this for blue. Hold up, dive down. We're just going to swing with both. No big deal. He can block one of them. But then we're taking a card draw, which is fine with me. Siren Storm Tamer, excellent. We have a very solid board state right now. Oh, two lands. Sucks. Hmm. Alright. I think the best bet here might be to go River Sneak. Uh, hmm. Yeah, it's debatable. I think we will. I think we're going to go River Sneak. Have Dive Down held up, and then we can uh, swing it for a lot next turn. He just gained so much life last turn, though. It's ridiculous. Hmm. Okay, Veraska, huh? Your thoughts will make a nice souvenir. Oh, trying to destroy Kumena. I'm gonna let her. Because we can kill her and not have to worry about it. No blocks here. gonna go for the face right now if we need to attack uh, Veraska next turn we can it's not a big deal because we can kill her next turn but she's not that scary right now they got plenty of cards in their hand though okay that'll resolve who are you targeting no Hexproof. Well, they could sacrifice Chupacabra. Probably be able to bring him back at some point. Curious Obsession is pretty darn good. Did they forget to do the plus? Okay, they just didn't want to do it. We 
we'll get the card draw here. We will still swing at their face. And then if we need to Titanic Growth the Kumeno when they block, we will. Or we can just hit it straight to their face. Okay, that's fine. So you know what? We're just going to hit them straight to their face. They got a lot of work to do next turn. Oh, excellent, actually. They might be able to gain a little bit of life here. We'll see. I don't think they'll be out of range, though. Varaska can't do nothing right now. Yep, so they're going to gain a little bit. Not enough to really help them enormously. What else you got in your hand? Okay, so back comes Chupacabra. So we're going to have to watch out for that next turn. Oh, now we got Siren Storm Tamer. Sacrificing, oh, okay, a land, all right. Okay. So we are looking to be in fantastic shape. We basically won. So all we got to do is tap something down. Yep, <laughs> he knows. <laughs> Good game. Now, Gary mid-range is a good matchup, but we typically will beat them out every time. Uh, I haven't lost too many times against Gelgari mid-range. But cool. Well, hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned. Uh, I don't know where I'm going to take this series from now on as far as the quick ones go. Uh, like I said in my previous video, I might uh, end counting the quick ones here and just do more of play till I'm done type thing. Play multiple games, win, loss, no matter what it is and just do it from there instead of always going for just the daily win on merfolk it was fun we did 100 episodes i think it's a good place to call it quits and then just do rank play win or loss you know do whatever we need to do for the day uh the daily video so if you like that idea or if you want me to continue with just showcasing merfolk wins let me know in the comments below leave a like and we will see you guys in the next video